Hello, uh, my name is Lenny Koor and I represented uh, the Netherlands in Madrid at the Eurovision Song Contest 1969. And I was one of the four winners with my song, The Troubadour. Hij zong voor boeren op het land. Een kerelse lied van eigen hand. Hij was van elke landstand. De Troubadour, de Troubadour. I was a week in Madrid, I remember. A week. And so the first days there were all sort of, there were just uh, orchestra re uh, rehearsals. Um, and, but the strange thing was that I couldn't do the rehearsal because the arrangements, you know, the papers, you know, it didn't, it didn't, um, they didn't receive it. it. It was just sent by post, but it was stuck somewhere and nobody knew where they were. But I was not nervous about it because um, uh, I thought even when there is no orchestra, I can play it with my guitar player, with the two of us. And we will do it like this. The director, the Dutch director, he just wanted to do his job, of course. He didn't want to be put aside. For, he, for him, it was a real issue. So he said one night, I think I'm going to make, to remake the arrangement. <laughs> Can you imagine? So he was already starting to remake an, another arrangement. And, and this morning, the fourth day, they arrived. So they were, they were stuck at the, at the, I said, the border uh, station. I was also nervous, you know, when, with, with, when they vote for the, for the votes, And I was hoping, well, if I only ma may end somewhere in the middle, I would be satisfied. That's what I was thinking, because there were a lot of songs that I liked. For example, I liked um, Frida Bocca's song very much, um, uh, Un jour un enfant. Un jour se lèvera vers les branches de lila. Qu'un enfant regardera comme un livre d'image. And I knew that Lulu, he had, she had a very nice song as well. Uh, but I had no idea, you know. So, these rotations, and then all of a sudden, um, there were four winners. <laughs> and I didn't understand what happened. I just didn't. The guitar, it's a really nice story. I was wondering, uh, some years ago, where did I leave this guitar that I won the song contest with? Where was it? It was a Levin guitar. Levin. It was from Sweden. And I, I bought it, I think, when I was 16 uh, from my uh, guitar teacher at the time. Uh, he had a shop and it, it, his name was written on it is the, the name of the shop was written on the, on the, on the, on the guitar. It was like a sticker, you know. But I could not remember where I did leave it. One year ago, I suddenly got, I, I got a, a phone call. Uh, it was the widow of the one I had a relationship with at that time. He was a lot older, like 10 or 15 years older than I was. He died. Uh, and um, I, I gave him the guitar because, at that time because he said that he wanted to play guitar. And I think, I think that, of course, I had more money after the song contest and I bought myself a new living guitar, a new, another guitar, a better one. And uh, I gave this to him. And he always kept it because after the, the relationship broke, he was also always proud that he, he had the guitar of Lenny Kuhl with which she won the Eurovision contest. So his wife, she knew that this guitar, that it was my guitar, And she had the intention and the desire to give me this guitar back. Yeah, so here, he has a sticker on it. Uh, so it, it had, had to be the guitar, uh, the, the right guitar. But I didn't recognize it because this used to be more, a little bit like, not white, but, you know, more like white. 
And it became so rare. And so they told me, of course, after more than 50 years, more than 50 years, uh, it, it, changed, it changed its color. So we recorded the troubadour at, at the rooftop of a museum, like a few weeks before the uh, broadcasting of the Eurovision Song Contest. Um, because it was impossible to do that all at the same time. So I understood that, but we were singing live, we really were singing live. Um, but they choose uh, uh, um, to, to, to record it at a very late hour. Um, it had to be dark and so, but it was, the wind was blowing heavily and, and it was freezing cold. It was like four degrees uh, and because it, the wind was blowing, so, so I had to, to put some, you know, like luck, you know, I say it, luck on my, on my hair that it was not moving all the time. Um, but it was, uh, it was nice. Uh, the album, we still are not finished yet. We still have to do some, uh, the violins and, and things and uh, some songs I have to sing again. Um, it will be released in the, uh, in, uh, I hope, in the month of, of, of October. Yeah.